Woods. So it, it meant a lot. I was I was pretty nervous and emotional up there about it. You know, and I when I wrote it, I was I was calm, but not saying. Get ready to step into the wild world of one of music's most enigmatic figures. Today, we're turning up the volume as we delve into the exhilarating lifestyle and jaw-dropping net worth of the legendary Axl Rose. From his electrifying stage presence to his larger-than-life persona, we'll uncover the secrets behind his success and take a peek into the rock star lifestyle like never before. W. Axl Rose, born February 6, 1962, is an American musician. He's best known for being the lead vocalist and lyricist of the hard rock band Guns N' Roses and has been the band's sole constant member since its inception in 1985. Rose has been named one of the greatest singers of all time by various media outlets, including Rolling Stone and NME. Uh, it was my understanding she had actually talked about it, the situation. So that's why you know, I was asked to do it. Now let's take a look at his favorite hobbies and interests. Rose has a collection of vintage amplifiers that's worth an estimated $1 million. He has a custom-made Les Paul guitar. This guitar was made by Gibson Custom Shop in 2004 and is worth an estimated $250,000. Rose has a pet cat named Dexter Marinello Rose. Rose has used Twitter to criticize various figures in the Trump administration, as well as other figures such as Apple CEO Tim Cook. Rose was arrested over 20 times as a teenager in Indiana. Rose loves to eat Italian food, especially pasta and pizza. Rose is a big fan of movies and has said that he enjoys watching a wide range of genres, including action, drama, and comedy. Rose has cited Queen as his favorite band and Mercury as his favorite singer. With Coachella uh, agencies and things. So they were having these conversations about what they could possibly do mm -hmm. or not. So it was all being considered. Let's see how he is getting on with his family and friends. In early 1986, Rose began dating model Erin Everly. In the spring of 1990, the couple tied the knot in Las Vegas. Less than a month later, Rose filed for divorce. The couple was able to reconcile the relationship for some time, but Everly eventually left Rose following an altercation. They annulled their marriage in January 1991. Shortly after his split from Everly, Rose started a relationship with supermodel Stephanie Seymour. In February 1993, Rose and Seymour got engaged, but ended up separating only three weeks later. It's been rumored that Rose and singer Lana Del Rey dated. He's a friend of former Skid Row singer Sebastian Bach, who's occasionally joined Guns N' Roses on stage. He's the oldest child of Sharon Elizabeth and William Bruce Rose. Everybody's people were finding out about possibilities and things like that, and then mm -hmm. we started talking together in the spring and so. With that being said, let's discuss how he earns money. In total, Guns N' Roses has sold well over 100 million albums worldwide, which is enough to make them one of the best-selling bands in history. In 1991, the band released two albums, including Use Your Illusion 1 and Use Your Illusion 2. Axel earned $39 million from these albums. In 1993, his earnings from the album titled The Spaghetti Incident, which he released with Guns N' Roses, was $5 million. Rose made $1 million from the compilation album titled Use Your Illusion in 1998. Between June 2017 and June 2018, Rose earned $20 million from his various endeavors. The majority of his earnings came from touring after the band reunited for the Not In This Lifetime tour. The tour went on to generate more than $430 million worldwide. Axel also makes money from brand endorsements with brands like Budweiser and Dr. Pepper. He has a net worth of $200 million. Ever wanted to know where he lives? Get ready to take a virtual tour of his ultra-luxurious mansion. In the picturesque coastal town of Malibu, California, lies an extraordinary residence of Rose. He acquired this Malibu home in 1992 for $3.6 million. Imposing and elegant, the house boasts three bedrooms and three bathrooms, spread over an expansive expanse of 4,000 square feet. Each room, meticulously designed, exudes an aura of comfort and tranquility, inviting residents and guests to immerse themselves in this enchanting ambiance. 
With uninterrupted panoramic views of the mesmerizing coastline and the vast expanse of the Pacific Ocean, the residence stands as a testament to the splendor of nature and the allure of coastal living. And when he's not relaxing in his mansion, he drives around in one of the following cars. A Porsche 918 Spider, a Cadillac Escalade, a Bentley Continental GT, a Range Rover, The Rolls Royce. A Ferrari. an Audi R8. Rose owns a private jet that's worth an estimated $20 million. If you enjoy our videos, give us a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button support means a lot to us. It's hard to get the full picture of someone's lifestyle without seeing how they got there, so where did it all begin? At an early age, Rose discovered music as an emotional outfit. He began singing in the church choir when he was five, and during high school he joined the school choir and studied piano. In March 1986, prior to signing a contract with Geffen Records, he legally changed his name to W. Axel Rose. Rose was active in the local hard rock scene and played in a number of bands, including Rapid Fire, Hollywood Rose, and L.A. Guns. He worked odd jobs to make ends meet and even smoked cigarettes for a scientific study at UCLA. In March 1985, Guns N' Roses was formed, and within a year it attracted the attention of a number of major record labels. The band's first four-song EP was released in December 1985, Guns N' Roses was especially popular in the late 1980s and early 90s. The band's 1987 album, Appetite for Destruction, has sold nearly 30 million copies worldwide to date. The band's follow-up albums, Use Your Illusion 1 and Use Your Illusion 2, both released in September 1991, went on to sell a combined 35 million copies worldwide. Although Rose lived a mostly reclusive life since the late 1990s, he's the only band member that's remained with Guns N' Roses consistently since its inception. In 2016, Rose partially reunited with the classic lineup of Guns N' Roses. In 2018, Rose appeared in an episode of New Looney Tunes as himself, singing an original song, Rock the Rock. In 2021, Rose again appeared as himself in a cartoon, this time Scooby-Doo and Guess Who? The group released two singles in 2021, Absurd and Hard School, the first releases of newly recorded material since 2008. That's all for today's video. Thanks for watching it. But don't stop here. There's more where that came from. Check out our other videos for more great content.